Hello everybody and welcome to Let's Play Fazbear Fright Storage. So this is the prequel to Fazbear Entertainment Storage. Excuse me, sorry. This is the game they made before that. So I always wanted to play it. I'm really excited to actually find it and play it. I don't know why it took me so long to look for it, but it just kind of popped up out of nowhere. So I know the game now. So we're going to hop right in. I haven't played this at all. No play testing or anything, so I have no idea how it's going to run. Um, so let's just hop right in. New game. Night one. Those were some noises. Flick your mouse down to use the camera and flick it right to use a second monitor. You can also use the S and D Hello. keys. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Michael. I used to be the technician at Freddy's and was the one who contacted the owners of Fazbear's Fright after the place burned down. Trust me, the equipment you're using right now is much more stable and much less likely to catch fire. Ooh. Probably. Anyways, the building that you're currently in is a Fazbear storage building. Basically, when a character was scrapped, it was sent here to be used for parts, assuming its parts were still usable. That's why all the animatronics we found in the building were partially dismantled. I'm still working on repairing them, so not all of them are working yet. I'll keep working on them as the week goes on. Now, we're unsure whether or not this will be the final building that the horror attraction takes place in, but while we're still searching for a new location, we need you to keep an eye on these robots. So, allow me to give you a rundown of what to expect. As you saw last time, the animatronics tend to wander. Fazbear Entertainment was aware of this, so a security system was already installed. You have a security surveillance tablet, just like last time, except this one isn't mounted to the wall. You can use this to monitor the security cameras mounted throughout the building. If the cameras turn to static, don't worry, they'll be online again shortly. The next thing you should know about is what to do when Freddy and his friends get a little bit too close for comfort. To your right, you have a second tablet that allows you to activate and deactivate three heaters, one for each entrance to the room you're in. If somebody is, let's say, on your right, turn on the right heater. The animatronics are programmed to avoid temperatures hot enough to cause them to overheat and will leave. Once they leave, you can turn the heater off again. Simple enough. You're probably thinking to yourself, well, why can't I leave the heaters on the whole time? There's two reasons. One, your room would become uncomfortably hot and your legs would start sticking to your chair. Two, Mangle. Mangle is that pink and white fox that you can see in the back room with the other characters. Now, Mangle was originally in a room called the Kid's Cove, which is where all the toddlers would be. To help keep track of them, Mangle was given thermal imaging. I know this because, well, I was the one who originally installed it. Now, that creates a problem since heat is your main method of defense. If you leave the heaters on for too long, Mangle will start crawling through the air vent connected to your office. You don't want that, so use the heater sparingly. The last thing I need to go over is the animatronic from the last location, Spring Bonnie. It survived the fire, most of it at least, so it's in the building with you now. The problem is, since this animatronic is much older than the others, its programming isn't as advanced. This means that you can use the heaters all you want, but it won't work on him. To compensate for this, We've installed a button that lets you administer a controlled shock into whatever room you choose. It's too weak to affect Ms. the other, but it should work on him. So, to recap, use the heaters if somebody comes near, don't use them long enough for Mangle to start moving, and shock Spring Bonnie to get him to stay away. I think that's everything. See you tomorrow. I... I know a balloon boy left, but I don't know where he... I, 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 he... I see him in the background right there. Bonnie's still there. But there's so much new information. I'm gonna die. <sighs> so Bonnie. Chicas, Mangle and Freddy's still there. Springtrap is here. Okay. So Springtrap's there. Bonnie's here. Chica, Mangle, uh, Freddy. Not anymore. Oh, don't you dare. Go back to where you came from. Uh, where's Bunny? There you are. Springtrap still there. Chica, Mingle, Bonnie's there now. I got Springtrap back in his little room. He keeps going there because it's the only way he can go. I just gotta keep an eye on him. Okay. 4 a.m. Almost with the first night. I don't want to open. Yours. 
You've seen better days, buddy boy. I mean, it's not. It's definitely not as refined as the newer one that they made. But holy crap, this is freaky. Okay, so I'm assuming... Is it right? Is that right? Or is it like... He has to be in here. I'm assuming he has to be... In oh my freaking goodness! Nope, it was... It was that. The shock button can both move spring trap back and stun him. That wasn't spring trap. That was funny. So... It feels so gross. Like, I don't know what it is about it. It's just gross. <laughs> it just makes me feel uncomfortable. It's like they just feel wrong. Why won't you let me honk the nose? Where's the nose? Let me honk the nose. These nights take so long. Oh. I know the puppet's gotta be here somewhere. Bonnie left. Bonnie's there. So your pattern is there. So da da da. And then you're either gonna go there, go this way, or you're gonna go down this way. So next up is either there or there. You're still there. Good to know know his pattern already because they are following legitimately the places they can move they don't skip anything right now because it's only night one I might play more of this I don't know I think I'm only gonna play this one the one time here um, but we'll see I'm just probably gonna I'm gonna try and get as far as I can in the recording session I got here I really want them to make another one because that entertainment storage was amazing like it was so cool and so well done like I want to see a third another iteration of it oh there he is right there shock yeah you're gonna be either there yeah you're gonna go around this way so next up you're either gonna be there or there um balloon boy's still there the other three are still there is it, is balloon boy yeah um is there anything in the vent Okay, so now I know, though, is that when they're there, in the cameras themselves, not in these lights, I have to turn the thing on. I just gotta pay close attention, and I like that the cameras freak out when any of them move, not just the person you're looking at. So that way you know something's moved, you just don't know what specifically. It's like unsettling in a different way because they stand so still. Are you there? Or are you there? Yeah, you're gonna come down to this one. So after you move, uh, but anyway, what I was saying, is like they're unsettling in like a different way because they're just standstill picked like screens. The animatronics aren't moving, and it just feels wrong because <laughs> they're so still. Um, so that was a quick one. Uh, but what was I saying? Uh, unlike the newer one where they kind of jolt and jitter in the in the cameras which just feels even creepier because they feel more real this one is just like an entirely different type of feeling and scare and creep factor but I really like it it's really interesting you got different eyes I do not like it. I have a feeling this means one of you is going to... I think it's going to be Chica. Is going to try and be coming down that right here. Yeah. I think Chica is going to be on that one. Oh, there you are. Uh, right. Oh. Okay, it worked. But now where is he? Oh, he goes all the way back? That's great! That's gonna be really difficult to manage. <laughs> Cause
because the moment he's gone, I have to turn it off immediately so that you don't get up and try to come out here. Okay. We're almost done with night one. It's easier than I expected. I just didn't really understand what I was doing. I, I can see how this is going to get much more difficult, though. So... Who's gone? You? Go back home. Goodbye. I still have no idea what he actually looks like. I saw that. <laughs> I did it. Yes. I did it. Night two. That's my sound effects. You're going to move much faster Hello, tonight. Guys. Now, I'm going to keep things brief today since you will not only have to worry about more animatronics as I repair them, but the animatronics that were already active are starting to become more active as well, so keep on your toes. That's okay. The main reason I'm leaving this message is to inform you that we're working on finding another animatronic that I don't particularly like that much. All models of it were supposed to be destroyed, but your friend is more than eager to track one down. And since I'm part of this now, might as well help him. It's for the sake of the attraction, you know? All right, I guess I should let you get back to your job. Have a good night. No. So... You were only the only one active because you were the only one repaired at the time. Why do I have your arm on my desk, by the way? Okay. I have a feeling each of those, like, camera, sh camera shifts thing, the snow, the static... I have a feeling multiple of them are going to be able to move at a time when that happens. So I'm just checking all the cameras I can when that when that does happen. I gotta remember. Oh, Chica. Ho, 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 ho. Where's Bonnie? Where's Bonnie? Chica's there. Where's Bonnie? Where's Bonnie? There's Bonnie. She goes there. Okay, I guess only one of you are going to show in that camera at a time. So you're both still there. Chica's going to go down to the left. Bonnie's going to go to the right. I have a feeling whenever Freddy's made or repaired, he's going to go front and center. And that's going to be the whole thing. Chica's still there. Bonnie's here. Springy Bo is there. Go back home. Springy Boy, Balloon, Bonnie, Chica, Freddy, and Mangle. Okay, we got this. That is truly awful, and I hate every second of it. <laughs> that is disgusting. <laughs> it's a good thumbnail, though. <laughs> Alright, next up is gonna be one of you two moving. I have a feeling. Or he's gonna do another little jolt. Yep. Right. Okay. So you're back up there now? Okay. Got it. Go back home. Is this specifically... How do I deal with Mangle with when he wakes up? What's the point of the vents? I'm confused now. And I'm worried. This is going to be crazy. Oh, somebody's moved. There's, you're still there. So Bonnie's there. Springy Boy's still there. Chica's there. Yeah, we're good. We got this. Chicken to chicken, bonnet to bunny, and spring trap to butt face. And if Chica comes down and Bonnie's nowhere to be found, that means they're in the same camera because for some reason they can't be seen together. They don't like each other. I don't know why. They, it's a whole thing. It's drama. I don't want to get into it. 
I don't want to talk about people's personal lives. There's Chica, there's Bonnie. And it's not my place to talk about the drama. It's fine. Ooh, I just don't like talking about it. I have a feeling the reason they're trying to get me is that I don't spill the beans to everybody, but that's fine. It'll, that's fine. That's fine. We're fine. I was right. They both moved in one little frame. Instead of only one of them moving when the thing happened. They both moved. Chica's still there. Freddy, right? Who's... Okay, we're good. You're not repaired yet. Time's almost up anyway. I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm good. Maybe. Bonnie's getting really close. Oh, I did it. We're good. Okay, so I'm not going to be able to continue playing. What I'm going to do is immediately mute the call so I don't listen to it because I don't want to be spoiled. And then I'm just going to let Mangle come kill me because I want to see their jump scare. Mute. Uh, D. All the heaters. Come and get me. Now we wait. <laughs> that scared me really bad. <laughs> okay. Um, that's all the time I got for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out the links in my description below for more things that I've done, including my website that has links to all of my music available on Spotify, Apple Music, and everywhere it can be streamed. Also, go check out my other YouTube channel where I post music covers as well as music videos. I have my music video out called... E from the blah, blah, blah. I have my music video for the song Easy As Dory Me. Go check it out if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Peace. I don't, I still don't know why I do it, but I'm stuck with it forever now. Three, two, one, bye. <laughs>